Well, it's a new day, and just kind of want to give you the tour of this place we're staying at. I was not expecting to stay here, but we did. Shoes to gank on, I think it's called. And you come in here, greeted by the living room and dining room and the kitchen. Um, I was explaining to the to I, the person we're staying with, that this this is actually a house, but this is actually about the size of a normal apartment in America, where you got the bedrooms upstairs, which I won't show you, for you know their house, and downstairs. <clears throat> is your living room, dining room, and a little kitchen. What is that? Oh, that's a thermostat. <clears throat> this is the kitchen. And kind of a skinny little fridge. Closet. And in here we got the, the toilet, which of course, whoop, that's pretty much what they look like throughout Japan. And every time they flush, a little tip is that flows up with water because it uses fresh water and you can wash your hands with it. Um, powder room. And this has probably been the biggest bathroom that I have used since we've been here. <clears throat> and then here, of course, is your shower. And then what I thought was really cool about this bathroom because it's the first one that had this. Yes, there is a TV for the bathtub. Oh yeah. And then here's the thermostat that was connected to out, out in the living room for the water. Pretty snazzy, pretty snazzy. And this is your fan controls to control the fan in the shower. Well, that's about all I can show you here. Um, so we're gonna get ready. We're gonna go on, I'm gonna feed some deer by hand today. Yeah, gonna feed some deer by hand. Now this is a little monitor that shows what's going on outside if somebody rings it. Let's see what this button does. Hello? Hmm. Don't know. Thought maybe somebody rang it. You can hear the birds. And the TV. <laughs> the TV's not even that loud. That's funny. How do you turn it off? This one? Anything. I don't know what that did. It's good. It's gonna turn off. I wouldn't worry about it. There's nobody there. <laughs> but yeah, that's just, I want one of these. Oh, and it's got your volume controls. Um, let's see here. Volume controls. Um, different modes. I better stop playing with it before I break something. They wake you up with music in this neighborhood. Hmm. I think it's coming from over there. Uh, now it stopped. Hmm. Q. I like this thing they have overhang for the cars. And if you want to know what the, what the camera's at, it's right there by the license plate. I had to go look for that because I'm silly like that. So yeah, we're getting ready to head out and begin another day. On our way to the store, look at the size of that building. Wow. There's even a bigger one over there, and those are apartments. Huge.
think that's where we're headed. So you want to buy a video game in Japan, right? <clears throat> say you're interested in Kirby here. Well, you just take your card. You can look at it. Flips open. Got your screenshots in there. Info about the game there. More screenshots. And on the back is where they scan it to uh, purchase it. How convenient. You can fit more games on the shelf this way. Ooh, a new, is that a new Zelda? Hmm. Ocarina of Time 3D. Hmm. Interesting. Well, found me a memory card. So from 100 bucks into these things already. They're not cheap in this country. Not cheap. Lesson learned if I ever go overseas again and want more memory cards um, to buy them in the States. And then, of course, they do have, looks like, packaged games over here. Um, so they do got a mixture of both. You know what? Actually, you know what? I think these are the download though. I bet you. Yeah, these are the downloads. Sorry, excuse me. The download cards. So, there you go. Boy, Japan's got all the good games. Some of these games I've never seen or even heard of. And here's your 3DSs. Need them. Ooh, what's this? Oh wow, boxed software. I haven't seen boxed software in years. Something we don't see in the States. Yep. Go, see what you get. This is gonna make a great way to get souvenirs for people. Let's crack it open. There you go. Who'd you get? Mario. Got Mario. We got yeah, this one. Oh, you get two Marios. Yeah, that's why I said we got this one. Cool. So you want to know how great the Surface Pro 3 is? Here we go, Surface Pro 3. And this one. This one's locked up solid. It is frozen up. Good way to advertise a Surface Pro 3. This one works over here. Um, this one works. So Lydia's not the only one with crazy hair. In advertisements, they do. <laughs> Look at that beautiful 4K TV. Oh wow, music store. Get your guitars. All that good stuff. Pianos. And if you look on the wall, I think, yeah. I think those are vinyl records up there. Wow. 
Wow. I think. Maybe they're music books. I'm not sure. But yeah. Beautiful pianos. <gasps> Look at this one. Oh, she is a beauty. Oh. Oh, those make noise. That is cool. Now that's some style there. That's some really good style. And then they got saxophones up here. Mostly, uh, looks like the one that my dad has, saxophone. I'll take a picture of the saxophone. Let me get them in there. Try that again. And then over here, you've got your electronic um, drum sets. Now here's an example of a production computer. Your monitors. Your keyboard. Your synthesizer. And then down here you got your software, like all your vocal aid. Looks like mostly vocal aid stuff here. Yeah, really cool. I need to get my setup up and running again. Okay, time for some lunch. Here. The whole squid looks so yummy. All right, let's go inside. Okay, this is the first restaurant I've been where you got to take off your shoes, <clears throat> and then we put it into one of these lockers. I put my. Oh, you can fit two pairs in there. Okay. Ah, there we go. Seventy-seven. Okay, did you get it? That's the waiting area. Food. Yeah, and we're gonna wait there. So we can go in there. Ah, you can see the fish. Oh. Ah. Oh, so they, they make them fresh, huh? That's what you call some fresh fish. They catch it right here in your restaurant. Wow. Ah. Even has a garden in it. All right. We're at our table. Mm -hmm. Oh. How do I get in there? Oh, okay, you put your feet in here. <coughs> uh, uh, ooh. Uh, there we go, I'm in. Mm. Mm. Arigato. Arigato. We will start it off with some tea and looking at the menu of drinks. Which looks really good. Aha! Here we go. <laughs> Sahibiru. Gotta love these menus. They all show pictures so you know what you're getting. Like in America, you just don't know. And this one comes alive. And you got your sashimi. Sashimi. This one includes the head. That was the one you were looking at, wasn't it? Oh, the full-size squid. Wow. Some raw beef in that one. Had kind of like what I had yesterday. Hey, we can do this. I'll show you later after we're done filming. Mm. Get the claws. And that's it. So what is this? Ah. I gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> he picked it up to call the order and it rang the phone and he comes running. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> We're gonna watch him cut the fish. Catch the fish. Catch 
<laughs> wow. <laughs> it's alive. Lydia's choices here. That was the one that we just watched get caught. And now he's on the table. <laughs> he is served. <laughs> it's a big bottle of beer. Ah. Ah. Mm, that stuff is real tough. That's a snail. Mm -mm. Their dinner has arrived, and we're still waiting for ours. <laughs> Here's mine. We got sashimi, kinds of extra goodness to put on it. Some dipping sauce, some udon, place to cook it, and tempura. And then you got the sashimi, right? Mm -hmm. A bunch of little goodies. This is rice. Pack one. This is chamoshi. Ooh. Yeah. And miso soup. Ah. And then you got the tempura. And the tempura. Mm. I didn't see what was in here. It's just my, that's my soup. Mm. All right, let's dig in. All right, now I got my udon cooking up. Mm -hmm. I think we could be any closer to this building. People walking around. Oh my goodness. Japanese roadways. Up, oh, get back on our bike. Oh, up. Oh. oh my goodness. Jeez. Scary driving. <laughs> oh. Took about inches away, man. All right, we're now in Nara. So we're gonna go possibly a tea ceremony place and then we're going to, well, go to these old shops and then go feed deer. Automatic going doors <laughs> while the vehicle's moving. Oh, I... nuts. A bowl. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pick that one. Mm -hmm. Like that one. Mm. Like that one. Mm. It's real nice. Beautiful day. Beautiful day. Okay. So what is this? Is okay. Okay, so we just got this. I'm not sure what we're doing with it yet, but I'm about to find out. Somehow ended up sitting here. We got this here. Teacup. This. That thing. And this thing. And I'm clueless on what to do. I made it. I made my first tea. I did it. Well, that was a very, very fun experience. And now, we go off to feed some deer. We got the all. Alright. And now, we're going to a Buddhist temple. And then we're going to go the deer. Okay. Well, here it is. If you ever want to come here, it's in Nara. And you can do the Japanese tea ceremony. 
couldn't show you it because it was a lesson, so it wouldn't have been right to record it. So I just showed you the before and ending results. So hope you enjoy anyways, guys. So I guess we're going down this way. Hmm. This is a very nice street here. I like the design of the street. Very Japanese. Oh, is he? Okay. I like this street. Very um, traditional looking. 